Okay. Let's go, let's go, this is perfect. Yup. <laughs> we got it. Yay! Finally. Hello everybody, in this video we're going to take a look at a game called Full VR Ball. And this is a bowling game uh, in virtual reality for Oculus Quest and Oculus Quest 2. And this is actually the first time I'm trying it. Uh, I got a key from the developer to check it out. And uh, first of all, if you want the bottom line, I was blown away. But if you want to see why I'm blown away, well, you need to stay and see what makes this uh, bowling virtual reality game so amazing. Now, this game is perfect for me because sometimes I'm just too lazy to go to the bowling and sometimes my friends can't or sometimes I'm in an area where there is no bowling because I travel. So for me, it's amazing because you can have a bowling arena whenever you are. All you need to do is just wear your VR headset and there it is. You have an arena, bowling arena, we can just play bowling. Now here you just can see the tutorial, um, we're gonna skip to gameplay in a moment. Uh, tutorial is very uh, straightforward, just teach you the basics uh, of how to play. And, and the cool thing about this is that the game kind of combines arcade uh, stuff with the casual bowling game. So you have really cool arenas, amazing looking bowling balls, which I'll show you in a moment. And you can play it uh, single player, you can play it against other online players uh, around the world. Uh, although as of the time of making this video, I didn't find players because the game is uh, about to be released on May 27th and I'm making this video on May, 20, uh, May 22nd. So by the time uh, this game is released, more players will be available so we'll be able to play quick match against other players online. And you can also play it either free play, free play or practice. Or you can actually play it um, with um, other friends locally. So you just change headset. For example, if you're having three friends coming to your house, uh, first player just wear the headset, finish his turn, his or her turn, and then the other player uh, continue and so on. Now, before we jump into gameplay, I want to show you just the lobby. Um, this lobby, of course, you can choose the game you want to play, the arena, the different arenas, the lock as you progress through the levels. Uh, you can find, uh, see the balls uh, that are available. You can unlock amazing, amazing uh, uh, balls. I'm just crazy. Some beautiful with 3D effects and animations. There are so many of them. But when you unlock them, you still need coins to buy it. Um, uh, as you see, I just have 10. You can see my ranked 2 and I own 3. And you can actually put it in the bag, uh, the ones that I want to play. And each one, each ball actually has its stats. So again, you need coins to buy them. You can unlock them, but you need coins to buy them. And you can browse through them with the arrows, by the way. Uh, we're going to show this in a moment after we see some gameplay. Uh, and there's some really cool... Uh, also, they also explain about the physics. So really, you can really enjoy some really curved moves. It, of course, depends on the ball. And uh, some of the balls, even uh, there's one that actually the ball won't actually um, bump. So they are really cool, some physics. They play around this with an arcade. But of course, you can choose the one that you want to play. Uh, there's also a leaderboard, as you can see, global leaderboard. There's also a place on the wall for your achievements, so you can unlock trophies, which is really crazy. So many of the things that I want in a game are actually there. So this is the wall with the achievements. I got a few, just let's just start playing, which is really, really cool. Uh, yeah, let's jump into gameplay. I'm going to show you more of these really cool balls and other stuff uh, after this. So let's go and check out some gameplay. Uh, just keep in mind that the game does have music, really cool music, but uh, I, I actually muted it, the music because, you know, YouTube. Uh, keep in mind, there is music. So this is uh, where you actually choose uh, uh, the arena and the game mode that you want to play. So you just point at it and then you can select single player. You see multiplayer, which is online. Pass and play, this is a local co-op um, and sp uh, spare practice. You can actually choose uh, how you want to... Uh, position these spares are uh, visible so you can actually practice for example just one in the corner and ranked mode uh, which give you more xp by the way uh, so we can actually rank up faster your level so this is the holes you can pick uh, you can see the xp the coins that you get uh, this is the lunar the other one unlocked at the higher level uh, some really cool ones of course they save like the most impressive one of course for those who progress stay in progress uh, and by the way, the game looks absolutely amazing on the quest, hands down to the developers. So we're going to go and play some ranked mode, right? And uh, you just go to the door there. And by the way, the door changes and based on the arena you actually chosen. 
we're gonna show you of course the other some other ones uh, in a moment uh, but let's check out some gameplay now a few words about the different options that you have uh, you can actually recenter with the oculus uh, button on the right hand controller uh, press and hold it to recenter uh, what you can do also is just aim towards the ball and use the uh, grip button to grab a ball from far away this is another option that you have uh, this that's why you can actually play it seated you don't actually need to go and grab the goal physically in that location uh, and of course you can you can just uh teleport uh, as well so let's check out some gameplay oh by the way when you first start look at this on the right side look how beautiful it shows you the pathing you see you can analyze your stroke this is amazing it is score very visible here at the top wow it's amazing let's try to concentrate because when you start a tutorial you have these lines that oh, look at this i can see my hands you can actually see lines that prevent you from going into these areas but now it's oh what is this one <gasps> golden pin uh, arcade stuff huh all right i shouldn't miss i shouldn't miss let's go golden pin let's go we got it golden pin i got stuff this was a good throw. Now, basically, golden pin just give you more coins. So, you actually, when you see golden pin, you really want to get it because this will give you extra coins. You can, after you unlock more balls, you can actually buy them with your coins. Something to keep in mind. Try to get it. I can actually see where I hit. You see, I supposed to eat where the arrow shows me. All right, more. So, let's grab the golden one. I believe in the golden one. All right, now they tell, they tell me where I actually should hit, you see? This area. Oh no. The position when I release the hand is so important. I'm failing. All right, again, again. No, I'm releasing here, you see? It goes straight there, not good. All right. Let's go. Now it really is kind of straight, nice. Good. Now here's another one, another level. Uh, this is the lunar one, which is really cool. And that's one of the great things about virtual reality. You can actually change the environment and enhance the gameplay experience compared to the real world equivalent one. Come on, this is a good one. Now, I need to do stronger, or maybe a bit to the right. All right. Ready? No, too much left. Too much to the left. Problem, I'm gonna take the gold one. My lucky. It's gonna help me out. Come on. You see, you need to see the lines. Oh! No, for some reason, there was a delay in the release, I don't know why. Try again. Let's go, let's go, this is perfect. Yep. <laughs> we got it. Yay! Finally. Finally I'm clearing everything. Okay. Ready? Set. No. Why? I thought I did it I did it straight. Alright. You disappoint me? I'm gonna go with the blue one. Alright. I think I'm kind of more for the left, so maybe I need to kind of adjust my throw a bit to the right, just... Yeah. <laughs> That's what I need to do. Spare! Spare me! <laughs> nice. So this is our last one. Last throw. And let's do this. Yeah, I'm doing it. No! Actually, this was a good one. Eight. Total, 86. Oh, another one. Another one. We are not over yet. I forgot the rules already. <laughs> okay, ready? Yep, both of them out. It was a good throw. Nice, this is our last one. See? 
Oh, this you see is curved. The way I throw it, but <laughs> was bad. Gain XP and I also got coins by the way. You see? Coins earned eight because of the golden one. So what I'm gonna do here is just uh, the practice mode and the practice mode is actually, for example, if you want to practice the spares being located in different locations, you can actually choose it uh, and then practice. And this is actually really, uh, really good because in many situations where they are after the first strike and having trouble hitting the other one. So uh, especially on the corners, if you want to practice, for example, hitting the corners, this is a place to do it. Uh, so as you can see, this is the Luna. Look how beautiful it is. Look how beautiful it is. Amazing. Uh, don't expect something realistic. Yeah, the way is to must just make it beautiful and, and a great place to be in and, and playing uh, bowling. As you can see there, uh, you can soon see, uh, I can actually decide how uh, to put a wish of the um, pieces that can I, I want to be visible. So I can actually, in a moment, you can actually see it. Just hit this one. But if I want to change it, all I need to do is just tap and either make it visible or invisible and then uh, set it and what happens those who actually now will just uh, be replaced with a new setup of the pins pretty cool huh now here uh, you can actually see me grabbing from far that's why I told you, you can even play it seated but you don't even need to walk you just point it and press the um, uh, grip button and you can actually see by pointing uh, add the ball the stats of the ball you see the stats and you can just grab it it comes to your hand and you can continue throwing this makes it very very comfortable this little thing these mechanics are super important uh, to make it uh, you know uh, work in different type of uh, you know preference for different people uh, so again if you want to play seated standing room scale it's all available for you it's very very comfortable keep in mind by the way some of the artifacts you see on the screen is because of the recording of the Oculus Quest, uh, the game looks amazing. It's not a problem uh, with the game. Just the Oculus Quest. I uh, need to check it out. Sometimes it records with, uh, you know, different type of uh, visual artifacts. And just something to note. And the one thing I want to show you, of course, is the selection of balls. You can see uh, many of them are locked a certain level, and if you unlock them, you can actually buy them. Uh, which is pretty cool because there are some amazing ones. As you can see, I'm just pointing out. Uh, my uh, the pointer and I can see the stats of the ball and I can actually hold it as well um, if I press the grip button which is pretty cool you're gonna see it in a moment so some of them are amazing I think this is one of the coolest things I mean if you like skins in games to unlock skins uh, you love this because we are really invested to create some really amazing uh, looking balls and just throwing them would be amazing one of them actually looked like Saturn was crazy with rings insane and this is actually the one that can i can actually buy and put i didn't buy it here but i can actually put it there and i need to buy it by the way i, mean, I, I unlocked it but i haven't i need to buy it still with gold all right so you need to think maybe you should kind of save and um, buy it for later yes yeah, so overall my first impressions uh playing uh full vr ball is well this game is insane it has everything uh, I want in a bowling game. The graphics are beautiful. Uh, the, the, the physics of the game, just they just nailed it perfectly. The selection of different game modes that you can play either online or with friends locally or alone. The practice mode, the tutorial is great. Uh, the ability to try a different ball with different physics, the different type of levels that you have you can unlock as you continue playing. The rewards uh, that you get uh, on the wall the sound effects the music uh and also of course the ability to play this uh in room scale standing or even seated because of how well the mechanics actually designed here to make it very very comfortable to play this is just an amazing amazing game so again this is my first impression of very very positive again uh, the game comes uh, to oculus and oculus quest 2 uh sorry <laughs> oculus quest you know, and quest 2 on may 27th my opinion highly recommend especially if you like bowling games you will have a blast playing this game. So again, until the next video, I'm going to show probably more videos about this game as I continue playing. Uh, but this is kind of first impressions. And as you know, I'm very impressed with this game. So until the next one, thanks for watching, everyone. Cheers. Bye-bye.